All right, guys, trying to figure out how to do the legs here on the sled. Um, I was looking around um, some different options and I was digging through the scrap bin and uh, I found these, uh, these pieces of tube that I saved that were actually from the bottom part of an old fan, exactly like that one. So I saved the pieces, um, taking a measurement. There, that don't, that'll work. And the other cool part is they actually come apart right here. Now this tube is, it is steel, but it's a really thin gauge, so it's really lightweight. And I'm hoping that I might be able to attach this side to the skis, this side to the sled, and then it'll be collapsible. I'll be able to uh, take it all down for storage. So um, I think that's the route I'm gonna go here for the legs for the sled. It just happened to work out that I, that I had these pieces. So uh, I'm gonna get them cut up and uh, start taking measurements. Let's do this. All right, next I'm gonna cut the small plates to uh, actually attach to the skis. Um, I decided to use two inch. All right, next we're gonna clean up these edges and round these corners. Mark out, center punch, and drill the plates uh, to put the bolts through. Hey guys, I was struggling a little bit trying to uh, find out where to mount the brackets on the skis uh, because the skis actually taper at the, the fronts and at the ends. So what I ended up doing was just squaring up a couple pairs of sawhorses, lining up the sled where I wanted the skis to actually mount to the sled and then finding the center of the actual spur, the holes where I need to drill. And then I, I just went around the bracket just to make sure I know exactly where it needed to be. So. Now that we got the skis marked out, let's go ahead and uh, drill where we want our holes here. Same bit in the drill press. It's an 82 degree angle, which a lot of screw heads are. A little piece of block of wood in there to drill against. And I got one of the screws here so we can drill a little at a time and test it to make sure that we don't go too far. Let's do it. <laughs> Now that we got these all marked out and uh, found center, let's go ahead and uh, get them welded on. Now I'm making the brackets to go on the bottom of the sled. Um, these need to fit over the one inch tube um, that I'm gonna be using. I uh, decided to go with aluminum for this. Uh, I'm using one and a half by one and a half by eight aluminum. Uh, I cut four pieces at two inches and then drilled them all out with a one inch drill bit. And now I'm going to cut this section out of each one. I have my brackets here just a little bit too small to fit over the tube. I'm gonna clean them up a little bit here, even them out. A couple little aluminum spacers that I'm gonna add in, so 
We're just gonna line these back up to where they go and drill through the sled. Alright, so next I wanted to find a way to attach the uh, attach the skis to the legs to make them easily removable but have them locked in place. So what I came up with was I got these locking pins here off Amazon. Just gonna go ahead and drill this hole through. Pretty sweet. We should uh, hold it in place and make it easy to, to take down. Sweet, that worked out nicely.